So guys, uh, this video is about how to fix the problem when your uh, SD card does not want to stay in the in the in the in the slot. Uh, this is actually the problem with uh, Sony Xperia Z3 Compact, but I guess uh, that the same problem could be in whatever computer, whatever uh, cell phone. Uh, I have seen some videos on the YouTube how to how to actually remove that uh, 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 how to actually replace that slot with the new one, so it's probably a known problem. And basically, look if I try to the the card is new actually, so if I try to fix their card, it goes away again. So I was thinking how to how to fix it. I did not want to dig inside. I was thinking about gluing this whatever, and I come up with the conclusion, which is really uh, simple, but I agree it's uh, not so comfortable. And uh, for this conclusion, you need only two things. One is this uh, rubber band. You can get them everywhere. You you go f to supermarket and actually they use it in the supermarket to fix some some vegetables. So you can get it there. It's rubber band, and you'll need this also. How it's called a plastic zip bag probably, which has this zip. You just tap it, and you're sure that nothing. Nothing goes outside. You can just have a look on eBay or usually if you go to the uh, place where they are selling uh, paper and this stuff, they have such bags there or they sell something in those bags so you can buy something and got it. And what's the fix actually? Uh, basically the bag you have for your uh, SIM card as for your SIM card and for this so it's pretty uncomfortable but you need the zip uh, zip plastic bag not to lose your SIM card because your SIM card is pretty valuable and uh, yeah so and how to use it actually so pretty simple I open this stuff here the Xperia really the, the, the way how Xperia does it is really stupid because there's a there's a port mini port for USB which I use for charging so if I use the cell phone for uh, for, for navigation for example in the car I always charge it via this way because the magnetic charger is pretty 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 slow so I have but I have to remove this stuff and there's the SD card so that's another disadvantage if you need to, to charge your phone you cannot use the solution uh, and uh, if you n need to transfer data via the USB you cannot use the solution so basically let's switch it off place the SD card close this rack and you see it pulls it outside because the slot is damaged and that's for what we have here this oops yeah you have to be skilled a little bit let's do it with two hands you should fix it properly yeah it switches on so let's switch it off not to t tuck any, any anything on the on the screen let's turn it around and make it harder and let's place it somewhere here so this is the solution it's not comfortable I can open it and I have here an app uh, yeah, it's pretty uncomfortable file commander and yeah now I see it in file commander yeah I, it's pretty uncomfortable this is the SD card yeah, SD card yeah yeah so you, now you can see the SD card what's on there and now you can use it but definitely once you will need to, to get into uh, your uh, micro uh, USB port so once you need to uh, charge it 
or once you'll need to transfer some data, you should remove it. And moreover, uh, for storage, I use this, uh, this kind of cover, which is safe because sometimes the cell phone falls and it's safe because it's not that open case, you know, I'm afraid of those open case to fall my cell phone. So it's not so comfortable to go this way. Well, it fits there so you can have it. But if you need uh, to do something on the full screen, you should remove it. So, well, maybe you can try this way uh, to, to take it, but then definitely for some manipulation you will need this. So maybe you can like put it here and do it. And that's a pretty stupid way I, I know, but uh, well, sorry. Sony, I will never buy Sony anymore because of that. It's crazy.